Okay, hello everyone, and welcome back to Spyro Pre-Ignited Trilogy. I'm Professor Icepick, and tonight we will be starting the second game in this uh, trilogy of terror, Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage. So, let me get started. Not, not expecting much of a crowd tonight, honestly, but who knows? Here's hoping, at least, right? Why did they write the copyright in comic sans? memory card, huh? Weird. In the world of dragons. Is this rain ever gonna stop? I've forgotten what the sun looks like. We should go on vacation. Somewhere warm. Somewhere sunny. Dragon Shores. Yeah, I haven't been there since we kicked Nasty Nork's butt. How about it, Sparks? You up for a vacation at the beach? Last one there is a Nork. Meanwhile, in the world of Avalar. Is it working, Professor? Almost. Just a few more adjustments to these orbs and... Maybe this isn't such a good idea. Bringing a dragon here could just make Ripto angrier. Calm down, Hunter, and stop fidgeting. But you saw the professor's book. They have claws like this, teeth like this, and they spit fire like this. They sound much more dangerous than Ripto. That's exactly the point. A dragon is our only chance of stopping Ripto, and you know it. It's working! It's working! I've got a dragon! Whoa, rough landing. Hi, which way's the... beach? Hey, stop staring. Haven't you guys ever seen a dragon before? You're a dragon? You got a problem with that pussycat? Well, well, someone forgot to invite me to the party. Were you trying to keep something from me? A dragon? You brought a dragon to Avalar? I hate dragons! Yes, yes. Kill it! Kill it! Go! You imbecile! You ain't my scepter! I'll deal with you later! Who is that jerk? That was Ripto, and we have to get rid of him. He's causing all sorts of trouble around here, but I haven't got time to explain. Here, take this magic guide to Avalar. It'll help you begin to understand our worlds. Right now, I have to follow Ripto and see what he's up to. I'll meet you in Summer Forest, okay? Hey, wait a minute. Uh, how do we get ourselves into these messes, pal? The adventure begins. I gotta say, Spyro's already a lot less annoying in this one. That's a good sign. Hi, Spyro! Welcome to Glimmer! Unfortunately for us, a mob of lizards just showed up and started stealing all of our gems. Can you stop them? Uh, okay.
Okay, well, that's kind of helpful, I guess. a hundred already. But of how many? Four hundred. Good boy. Hi, Spyro. I'm a friend of Alora's, and she's asked me to help you out. Whenever you find me, I'll remember your progress like this. That zap means that if you get into trouble, I'll return you to this place. See you around. Oh, hey, K.I., how's it going? That's good. I gotta say, the controls already feel a little bit better. Camera could still use some work. But it is what it is. So, what's the deal with the glowing orb thingies, anyway? It looks like they're another new collectible. Track gems, I do not. How do I, how do I do that? Let's see, guidebook. Okay, that doesn't answer my questions. Orb, magic pick. Hold all four shoulder buttons and point to the nearest. Okay, that's kind of helpful. Okay, so it's over there. <clears throat> Doesn't work if you're one hit from death because sparks won't be there. Fair enough. We gem cutters are a bit too short to climb these ladders. Looks like you are too. After you learn to climb, come back to Glimmer to see me. Okay, so it sounds like this is going to be one of those games where you can't get everything on your first try. Okay, so I'm gonna go over. Is it up here? Okay, I guess it is. Ah, you must be the dragon everyone is talking about. Well, dragon or not, I'm afraid there is a small fee to open the bridge. It will cost you 100 of your gems to cross. Yeah, okay. Thank you, Mr. Dragon. Spyro, was it? You can now use the bridge whenever you want, free of charge. I hope we meet again when you have even more gems. I like this guy. To get a good look around, hold down the triangle button. Try using triangle to look around this cave.
Pyro, thanks for helping us fight off the lizards. Please take this talisman of glimmer as a sign of our gratitude. Ow, the pickaxe. This magic portal next to me will take you to Summer Forest, one of the homeworlds of Avalar. So, do you think I've gotten everything I could at this point, or... Oh, wait, here we go. Enemy orbs don't carry between levels. Okay. But I take it gems do. Alright, fair enough. have eaten my entire crop of gems. I've tried hitting them with rocks, but they're too fast for me. You can try using one of my rocks. If you have any questions, just ask me. to the next lizard. <coughs> so do I get like a better jump or something you now as time goes on or that's ah, sorry I like having people around in general, okay? You can spit pretty far, Spyro! See if you can spit all the way to that lizard! <laughs> Okay, looks like I don't start with it. To hit that lizard up high, you'll have to aim. Press and hold the triangle button to aim, then press circle to spit. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Now, was that it? I hear him, but I don't see him. That. Wow, that seems incredibly shitty, honestly. Ah, oh, there he is. and hold the triangle button while you have a rock in your mouth. Okay. gems from the lizards. Here, take this orb. Some girl with wings dropped it here yesterday. <coughs> okay, one orb down, uh, two to go. Okay, I got 311 gems and 14 of those enemy things. me like the lamp spiral. A fairy gave me this orb, but I like gems better. You take it instead. Okay, that sure was.
Okay, it looks like I need to climb to finish this one up. So what say you, KI? Should I move on to the next area or keep trying to 100% this one? Okay, move on it is. We in Summer Forest. chance to introduce ourselves before. My name is Alora. Uh, hi, I'm Spyro. What are you, some kind of goat? I'm a fawn, you dork. Oh, sorry. Did you meet the gym cutters in Glimmer? Yeah, they gave me a souvenir too. They called it a talisman. They gave you a talisman? What, is it special? I just stuck it in the guidebook you gave me. There are 14 talismans in Avalar, and they are all magical. If you can collect enough of them, they can be used to defeat Ripto. Hunter, where have you been? I, uh, got a little lost. Spyro's going to help us collect the talismans. I am? He is. Spyro, look. There's no way you can get to Dragon Shores right now. Ripto and his monsters have taken over the castle here in the Summer Forest. You're going to have to go to Avalar's worlds and convince the inhabitants to give you their talismans. You can keep them in your guidebook. Hey, I could do that. Why doesn't the dragon just torch Ripto? Hunter, you can't even keep track of your running shoes. How can we trust you with 14 talisman? If you come across any orbs, they're important too, but I'll tell you about them later. Okay, no problem. I'll collect a few talismans, give Ripto the old hot foot, and be in Dragon Shores by lunchtime. Summer Forest. So, okay, question. Are these areas broken up into stages anymore, or are they just like straight up... Oh, hey, water doesn't immediately kill or hurt me in this game. That's an improvement. Spyro, this is the homeworld called Summer Forest. There are portals to many of the Avalar worlds around here. Unfortunately, Ripto has taken over the castle, and we need your help. Start by retrieving the talismans from each of the worlds you go to. Three hub worlds, summer, autumn, winter. Hi, Spyro. You look like you're pretty agile. Let's try putting it to a test. See if you can get up this first step. Press X and hold it down to get more hang time. Okay, not bad. Now, to make this next jump, you'll have to glide. Press X to jump, then press X again at the top of your jump to get the maximum glide distance. Now why do all the non-Spyro characters make my eyes kind of hurt? Nice job! Now try to do a hover. Press X to jump, then press X again to glide. Then when you reach the end of your glide, press triangle to hover. Hovering will give you extra height and distance. <laughs> Okay, I see what they mean. Very good. Now for the hardest leap of all. You'll have to give this one everything you've got. Get a walking start, jump, glide, and hover just before you get to the edge of the platform. Don't forget to press forward on the D-pad or analog stick when you hover. <laughs> Wow, you're a pretty good athlete. If I hadn't lost my running shoes, I'd take you on for real. For now, here's an orb for your collection. <coughs> Three orbs and a save file.
barks, the dragonfly following you around is your health indicator, Spyro. The brighter he is, the more hit points you have. Okay, well, let me just get all these gems first, and then I'll talk to them. Now, where'd he go? Ah, there he is. <coughs> Sorry, Spyro. I'd love to teach you how to swim underwater, but not as much as I'd love to take your treasure. Ooh. Okay, don't have enough to get that just yet. Colossus, what is that? The, is that the boss? Okay, let's see here now. 400 gems. No enemies, all right. No, it's just a lot. Oh, really? Okay. Well, might as well uh, make it my first then. Entering Colossus. Save complete. Paging around our home, but we've managed to trap him by shutting all the doors. If you talk to the other brothers, they will open the gates and guide you to him. Got 400 gems on every stage. Oh man, these guys are enemies too. If you say so. By concentrating, I should be able to open this door for you. So does it just kill like 14 separate enemies or kill 14 enemies, period, even like repeat? Fourteen separate, got it. Who needs a key when you know how to chant like this? So there are only three hub levels in this game, huh? Ah, dang. Okay, missed it. Enemies are 
weapons like those yaks are too big to be charged. Your flame attack should easily take care of large enemies. Man, they really don't think I played the first game, did do they? So does that mean that there are only three flying levels then, or are there multiple flying levels between? Each time you defeat an enemy, it will release a spirit particle. The spirit particles will activate the power-up in that world. If a power-up is inactive, you need to defeat more enemies. Yeah. All right, that's fair, I guess. Hey, look what I can do! Oh, one-up butterfly, huh? Neat. Remember Hunter's advice. You will glide farthest if you press the X button at the very top of your jump. I don't remember him saying that, but okay. I'm a vegetarian. I think you should kill that yeti. He's pretty tough, though. In fact, I'm not so sure you're up to it. Did he say kill?
Oh, thank goodness you scared that evil spirit away. But now it will hide in the statues. If you were to flame all ten statues, I'm sure you would chase it away for good. <coughs> okay. Hey, Bacon. Wait.
I thought the Yeti was tougher than that. I guess he was all bark. Ro -ro. <laughs> anyway, I was just guarding our sacred talisman to make sure the Yeti didn't eat it. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Collected all the gems. Ah, Spyro, welcome. We have found that hockey is a peaceful and calming sport. Would you like to join in a match against our goalkeeper? You have two minutes to score five goals in the red goal. Do I die if I fail this minigame or something? Or does it cost me a life or do I just start over? Oh, okay. What the? Let me catch up with that. Three, but I'm not going to win. Enough time. You must focus your thoughts to succeed, Spyro. Oh. 
Actually doing worse the second time. happened there did you see that it like you must it, it like evaporated or something okay that's one I feel like this almost makes me look like some sort of a, uh, I guess pool shark isn't really the right term here. Spyro the Dragon Hockey minigame shark? game of one on one maybe later uh, come back if you change your mind Man, it's not an unfair way to phrase it I guess oh I do okay I honestly thought that the other orb was going to be for wait how many orbs are there oh First one to score five goals. <coughs> well, technically, isn't this two on two then? No.
Oh, come on! Come on, guys, I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. Now where was I? <laughs> Woo! Was that three to two? That's three to two. What the? Where'd it go? That's four to two. What the hell? How did that go through? And that's fine. Well done! Have this! If you stare at it long enough, you might not see anything. I just need to find that last statue, and we're done. side quest radar, right? <clears throat> yeah, no, I have all the gems, actually.
See? All gems. Oh, there, Kirito, or Kirito, rather. I don't know how to pronounce that. I've never really watched Sword Art Online. Keep that in mind. Yeah, where the hell is that last statue? Well done, Spyro! You've scared the evil spirit away! Why don't you take this? I borrowed it from the temple. Yeah, they don't need it. Okay, that looks like all of those. Yep, Colossus complete. Okay, good. Take the warp back then. Saving, save complete. Hello there, Spyro. Would you like to learn to swim underwater? I suppose I could teach you for uh, a small fee. Great. Okay, when you jump in the water, you can use the D pad to move around the surface. 
Use square to dive underwater. When you are underwater, use X to paddle and square to charge. You're well on your way, Spyro. Keep collecting Talos <coughs> to help us defeat Ripto before he can take over Avalar. Oh, and keep collecting those orbs, too. The professor thinks they will help you get back to the Dragon World. Your game camera is currently in passive mode. This mode requires you to control the camera yourself and moves more slowly. If you like, I can change the game camera to use active mode. In active mode, the camera moves much faster. Nah, I'm good. Okay, I won't change it. Remember, you can change the camera mode yourself by using the options menu. Something shiny at the top of this wall. You could probably get it, but you'll have to learn how to climb first. Huracos. Kind of sounds like it could be a boss. Well, let's go to Sunny Beach. these little vignettes. Hi, Spyro. It's a good thing you're here. If you can help shepherd those baby turtles over there to safety, I'll be mighty grateful. Okay, that sounds like a side quest. I have no idea. The baby turtles will lead the way, but there are some obstacles in the way that they can't pass. If you can clear the obstacles away, the turtles will be able to make it to safety. Okay. Those turtles go. Okay. 
Okay. The water workers have boxed up most of our baby turtles. The boxes are incredibly strong. With a more powerful flame breath, maybe you could break them open and release the turtles. Okay. is like anyway. There's a chef at the top of this ladder who wants to make soup out of our baby turtles. If you know how to climb, you could get up there and stop him. Stop mocking me, game! <coughs> if only I knew how to climb. If only you didn't stop yelling at me to learn how to climb and not tell me where to learn. Thank you, young dragon. The baby turtles will be safe up here. Please take this talisman as a token of our gratitude. Well, at least I got the talisman out of it. Well, I don't think I can finish this level up. But...
Say, Spyro, you see this wall here? I bet you're dying to know what's on the other side. If only I had a few more gems, I might be able to remember it. Lower the wall. Okay, fine. Hmm. Yes, the sparkling beauty of those gems seems to have jogged my memory. <laughs> Nice work, Spyro. The orbs you're carrying have activated this special portal. You won't find a talisman in the ocean speedway, but if you're fast, you'll get lots of treasure. Have fun. Hey, boy. Welcome back. You're just in time to watch me crash and burn on the first flying level. <clears throat> I had to leave the turtle one because apparently I need to know how to climb to finish it, so... Try again, I guess. I'll just start with the rings again. Damn it. Okay. 
So doing all in one unlocks free mode. Okay, fair enough. This is going to take me a while to get used to. Okay, well, the cars were easy. Looks like the boats are gonna be my Achilles heel here. Okay, that was good.
Ah, okay. <coughs> Getting closer. Close, but I think I might be able to do it. No, damn it. I was so close. Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, well, at least we have a path to victory now. That's something. Oh yeah, but water is an instant loss. That's my problem. God, how did I miss the last one? Damn it. <sighs> I don't even know where the one I missed was. Finally! Yeah, okay, how do I do free mode anyway? 
Oh, this is... Okay, fair enough then. Okay, so, um... Any hints on where the pre-gem might be or whatever? I think the challenge is in the stands of the crowd. Okay. God, I hope it's not beat your last time. All right. Uh, let's see. God. I guess now you think I'm pretty good. Well, let's see if you're as good as the current champion. No. All right, Spyro. Meet the course champion. In order to win the race, you must fly through all the rings. Beware if Hunter flies through a ring first. The ring will start to shrink. Oh. <sighs> okay. I take it that I should have been following. Oh, okay. It's not as easy as. Shit. Couldn't even see where I was supposed to go. It's not as. So is it literally like beat him in a race or is it just like keep pace with him? Where the hell did he... God damn it. It's not a... Is it? Come on. It's not as easy. Oh, 
Come on! It's not... Where the hell? Where'd he go? Oh. It, okay, fine then. It's not. Near race segments like this. I don't know, am I the only one? Probably not. Okay, yep, yeah. okay, catching up. Okay, halfway done. No! No! Damn it! It's not as easy. <sighs> oh, come on! How did I miss that? Not as easy as it looks, is it? What the? How did I miss that? How did I miss it? It's not. Even you're too slow. It's you're too, you know, your steering's too bad. You have no handling. No, oh, no, no. Yes. Yes. Okay. Fine. Okay. No, oh, no, no. Yes. Okay. Oh, come on! How did I miss that? Ah, oh, damn it. It's not... The fact that this is difficulty four worries me. Oh, no, there, this this has analog stick uh, compatibility. Now, I just suck at this, honestly. Okay, yeah. No! No, come on! No, why? It's not... Okay, at this rate, this might actually be the last thing I do tonight. I intend to keep streaming for at least another hour. <laughs> Oh, no. 
no, 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 no. Why? It's not as easy as it's literally the furthest as I I've gotten so far. <laughs> Seriously, I find it bizarre that I love knights. Actually beat knights. Like properly? Like properly actually beat it? No, no, come on! No, no! No! Damn it! It's not a Is there like any way to adjust your controls here or something? Or am I like like is there like a sensitive nudge or something? I don't know, I feel like I'm cockeyed. Ah, oh, damn it. It's not a <laughs> Okay. It's not a Pisses me off that they that most people who were working on these games didn't even realize that PS1 had a second analog stick until like fucking Ape Escape of all things. Great that I love Ape Escape, but I mean I never actually finished it, I think of it, but I do love it. Ah shoot. It's not as easy as you thought, is it? So what was it? Was Ape Escape like the only one then or something? wonder why they even added a second analog stick so you know for the ps1 what was it like because we can or something okay no damn it ah <sighs> the water it's not as So, K.I., is this what all of the secret orbs in the flying stages uh, ends, end up uh, consisting of? Just, I, I take it that they they probably add more rings or something? Like, what, is the next one going to be like 30 rings? Is the last one going to be like 100 rings? No, come on! No! no. Oh, damn it! It's not as easy. I wonder if Dari is getting any catharsis from watching me do this. Ah, oh, damn it. No, no, no. 
it's not a uh, another 15 minutes down the drain with this. I do like rail shooters, although judging by how Spyro likes to do things, it's probably literally hit every enemy with every shot, get a 100% hit rate, or you lose. It's not a... Oh, and also you have to do a Rubik's Cube while you're doing it. I mean a literal Rubik's Cube, they, they provide you with one. Not like in-game, I mean they literally hand you a Rubik's Cube and you have to solve it. Oh crap! Damn it! Now that's the farthest I've ever gotten. It's not a God. Out of curiosity, are all of the uh, flying stages surrounded by water that instantly cuts out your momentum and, you know, forces you to restart? It's not Ah, no, 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 no. Uh. God, saying it's that it not... shrinks doesn't even feel right. It, like, evaporates. Is it? You'd better be right next to him, or it's gone. with the it's not the collision detection on these things is is so precise I think that the orbs are how I get the true ending, not like the true final boss or something, right? Oh no. No, 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 okay. Wait, caught up. Waiting. Oh! Okay, I missed one and I didn't even it's get to see where it was. Great. Thank you.
No, no, no! Come on! It's not. Well, screw that up from the start. It's not. Okay, and is the uh, bonus level part of uh, the 100%? Or is it just like for uh, giggles? Oh, thank God, it's that over. Was an excellent fly. I'll be honest, I had a panic attack when it didn't say 20 at the end there. Okay, that's finally done. Quit. Just, just quit. Okay, well, that's done at least. Damn it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's a good one. I have to admit, it feels good to laugh. Again. After that horrible, horrible thing, which... Hopefully I won't have to do another one of those tonight. I probably w will next time. Hey, hey. Ah, damn it. And clearly I have to get over there to get to that thing. Close enough again. <clears throat> so am I at least on the right track to get to that area over there that's like barricaded? Because I noticed that when I hit that, that door seems to go down. So do they like switch when I open it or something? Or is that just locked off from another direction or something? Yeah, no, I saw it open, so I'm clearly heading in the right direction here. All right, there we go. Made it. Okay, what's... Oh, yeah, another orb. Okay. Wasn't expecting that, but I'll take it.
Okay, yeah, clearly that is not the right way to go about getting that. Check your guidebook by pressing the start button and choosing the guidebook option to see which talismans you have collected. Okay. So out of curiosity, do you have any idea where... Oh. Never mind. I was going to ask if you knew where I might be able to unlock the climb, but... This seems way more pertinent, honestly. God, it's weird that they tease you so much about it then, right? It's like from the very first stage, they seem to imply that you get it relatively soon. Oh. Oh, okay. All right. You know what? That's cool. Okay, what am I missing? Okay, I'm missing one more. Are you enjoying the... Okay, so that's what he does. Huracos. Is Huracos the boss then? Okay, great. All right, so you're teasing me now, game. Okay, fair enough. All right, let's go to Aquaria Towers then. Funny-looking guys with the shock sticks have drained all our water. We can't get it back unless someone activates the switches they're guarding. Okay, I 
feel like I might have uh, jumped the gun on that one. Probably should have killed those crabs first. No, I know that. I'm just saying that it's a little bit harder. Okay, so it's, if it's 14, then no, 29! Jesus Christ. I admit, I do like how much more active Sparks is in this game compared to the first one. Spyro. You must be tougher than you look to get here. All the same, you won't be able to get past the metal sharks up ahead. I suppose I could let you borrow my submarine, though. For a modest fee, of course. A pleasure doing business with you, Spyro. This submarine is 100% shockproof. I guarantee it. Is this like a mini game or something, or like an orb quest or whatever? Oh. Oh, okay. Fair enough, then. Kind of feel like I wasted some money there.
Our world is wet again. We all want you to have this talisman of Aquaria Towers to remember us by. Okay. <laughs> Me too, honestly. Okay, fine. All right, is there another one of those pyramid dealies around? You know, with the power up inside of it. Oh, okay, never mind. I, I see what I need to do. Never mind. I got it. Fired at it though. What the hell? I'm still missing seven enemies then. Okay, fair enough then.
The water workers have kidnapped six of my children and hidden them in the tops of these numbered towers. I borrowed some explosives to blast the doors off the towers. If you can make it to the top of the six numbered towers, my children will be safe. Wait, are the rest of the entrances down below then, I'm assuming? expecting that to be harder than the first two. Are they gonna say that this is as hard as the ring flying thing? Cause I'm calling BS on that. I mean, I guess I can understand that, but come on.
Well, that was at least clever. You did it! Now we can swim in peace. I heard that you were collecting these orbs. Please take this one. Okay. <coughs> Herb. And there we go. Okay, let's go see what Hunter's up to. This better not be another race. Oh, what am I doing? I've been trying to tame my new pet manta ray, but he just won't obey me. Hey, you're just about the right size to ride on his back. Great. Hop on his back and guide him through each of the rings of bubbles as it appears. And remember, he's brand new, so try not to get him dented or scratched up. <laughs> Okay. Well done. I suppose I owe you something for that. Here, take this orb. I found it in one of my flippers. Yeah, see, listening to some of the dialogue in this game, it doesn't really surprise me that they... Now that the manta ray's tamed, I'd love to get him into racing shape. Care to take him through a harder course? <sighs> sure. Okay, good luck. Yeah, I'm gonna need it. Oh boy, four stars. What the? Pretty wild ride, huh? Okay, I guess I failed that somehow. Wait, is there like a speed up button or something? What the hell? Pretty. That time I didn't miss Jack. Damn it. Okay, that time I did. That time I'll give you. Pretty. Seriously. God, why don't I just call this one Spyro Man 62 or something? What? Okay, okay, hold on a second. Wait a second. <laughs> Pretty wild ride, eh? <sighs> Seriously, Dar's gonna be kicking himself if he slipped through. I did not even get there yet! Why did that not count? Come on, I didn't even... Did not even miss that shit. You could fool me. You know, why, why don't they tell me about this? Is there like a speed up or something? Okay. Mm. 
All right. Out of curiosity, what is it that you like about this? Because even with good controls, this is just aggravating to me. Shoot, I'm not going to make it. Thank God I made it. Oh, thank God, finally. Incredible. You've got real talent. I could use a partner like you. You can have the orb I found in my other flipper, too. Again, to reiterate, why did the why did the sexualized furry redesigns really surprise anyone? Just like out of curiosity. It why did it why did it surprise anyone? Alright, so that's done. Now I just need to find 95 gems and a lot of people seem to be. Alright, so. is that people got really pissed off at how sexy uh, Reignited made the kangaroo, honestly. Okay, he's pointing me, right? Okay. Talking about the kangaroo or the um, the fawn? I mean, I just think it's funny that putting more clothing on her made her sexy. to next. Wait, okay, yeah. be my last four enemies as well. Four enemies? Yeah, four enemies. Okay, so...
that's everything. Okay. Okay, I'm just missing ten now. So, where to? This way? Ah. <coughs> and there we go. Second stage complete. Alright, let's go to the exit then. level so quickly. Let's take a look at what Huracos is. <laughs> yeah, I probably will. Just wanted to see that cutscene. Could have sworn I had already gotten him, but well, let's check. Now that's Alora by the ladder. She's the one who kept on bringing up, oh, you gotta learn how to climb. There's Hunter, who changes your camera. Nah, it's cool. I understand. Press triangle to replay intro. I like that. That's that's nice. We've always had trouble with the gear grinders, but now they've set up force fields to separate us. If you can find diodes, you can use them to turn off the force fields. I think there's a diode around here somewhere, but my eyesight isn't what it used to be. It's creepy how much it sound that sounded like SpongeBob, right? Like, no, I get that that's Tom Kenny, but it's just weird hearing him use that in any context outside of, uh, you know, hear, hear him use a voice like that outside of SpongeBob nowadays, right? Fair enough.
exactly sure what the power up is in this one. Oh, okay, supercharge, got it. Grinder thieves keep taking our lightning stones. If you can replace them all and activate our generator, I'd be very grateful.
less difficult, the more tedious, honestly. I'm kind of surprised I got that one, actually. Okay, one to go. Spyro, I found this shiny thing mixed up with our lightning stones. Please, take it as a reward. <coughs> okay, so I killed all the enemies in the level. Spyro, you've deactivated all of the electric barriers. We've been guarding this talisman from the gear grinders. Please, take it as a reward. <coughs> OK, 
Okay, well, since it looks like I should be able to get everything, I guess I'll look around some more for uh, whatever I missed here, at least for a little while. At least until I find something I literally can't do. Ah, okay, hold on. Well, there's gotta be another pyramid here somewhere, right? Or whatever you'd call that, like the structure for the... Spyro, do you see that big building over there? The gear grinders are using it to steal our electricity. Please help us by shutting down the machinery inside. Spyro, you've done well so far. You can have this little trinket for good luck. If you have any questions about shutting down the factory, just ask me. <coughs> okay, not bad. The next glides get tricky. You'll have to use your hover maneuver to make them. Press the triangle button during a glide to hover and get extra height. Remember to press triangle when you are very close to the windmill or you won't make it. Oh boy, five star. Thank <laughs> you. 
Pyro, help! The switch to turn off the gear grinder factory is in that room, but, um, it's awfully noisy in there. <laughs> Thanks for shutting down the factory. Here, I found this stuck between the gears. You can have it if you want. Okay, that's the last orb. Still missing 11, huh? Well, that's 10. Yeah, tell me about it. And bingo, bingo, bongo. I mean, I respect that, but at the same time, Jesus Christ. <laughs> That's awful. Yeah, I think this is where I'm going to call it for the night. I was actually about to say that, but, yeah, wanted to watch that little cutscene. Okay, so, uh, just make sure that the game is saved. Okay, so until next time, this has been Spyro Pre-Ignited Trilogy. I've been Professor Icepick, and I'm signing off. See you next time.